The Cal Poly Mustangs kicked off their first game of the season against the University of San Diego. The Mustangs are under the direction of new head coach Paul Wolf with Washington transfer Sam Huard under center. Their defense, the highlight of camp, are looking to defeat the Toreros for a fourth straight time after last year's 28-27 victory. Let's get into it. Cal Poly up 10 to 3 with 337 left in the second quarter. First and 10, Sam Hoover dancing around the pocket, completes the pass downfield to Carlton Brown like a machine. He ends up getting brought down inside the five yard line. Second and goal on the one yard line. Hoover to Tyrese Fairley Diem, and he completes the catch for a touchdown. Another six on the board for the Mustangs. The field goal attempt is good. Cal Poly leads 17 to 3. Here comes the only touchdown for the University of San Diego. A pick six from number six. Ruben Lopez takes it to the house, and the Toreros are down 17 10 with the good field goal. We head to the fourth quarter. 226 left on the clock. Mustangs up a whopping 20 to 7. Mark Riggins rushes in for the final touchdown of the night. Cal Poly defeats San Diego 27 to 10. It feels amazing. Uh, you know, felt great coming out here, finally playing someone else other than ourselves. You know, we just knew that if we came out and played our game, we was going to get the job done. You know, we didn't really know what to expect coming into this game, but we just knew if we played our game, we was going to be solid. I'm just so blessed to have those guys up front protecting me, and uh, they were just giving me so much time back there to just really spread the ball around and get different guys the ball and go through my progression. So definitely makes my job a lot easier when, you know, I have to don't, don't have to worry too much about things going on up front, and that's just credit to those guys and all their hard work all off season and, and just the trust they have in each other and also just going out there every single day and really bringing it. I just think our guys came out and, and, and played hard, and, and uh, we did a lot of things. We didn't cap, but we got, we got grown to do, but this team's got a lot of potential to continue to grow. I'm excited to watch our guys play this next Saturday, but we got a lot of work in front of us, and we got to maximize these days that we have to, to improve and, and, uh, and see how it uh, looks come Saturday. The defense didn't give up a touchdown for the first time in seven years, ironically, to the Toreros. Cal Poly heads to San Jose State next week for Game 2, and that is it for sports. We will be right back after the break.